That's two partners you lost. Your partner died. Ah, 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 Dude, that is the best death scene ever. No! That is the best death... What is up everyone, Phil here making a very short video, but it's a really important one, okay? I've noticed in the last couple of weeks a pattern. Support has been slowing down significantly, in particular in the realm of tips. You're goddamn right. But here's the deal. Last year, I lost my partnership with Twitch, and when I did that, I went from 800 to 900 subscribers that were paying every month, now down to around 300 a month on YouTube. Now, yes, it's true. I just got gifted membership from my get right now. That's income I'm gonna get next month when I get my monthly YouTube payment. Also, things have slowed down in regards to things like Super Chats. For a while there, when I was playing big games, I was getting a good amount of Super Chats that were helping you really enable the ability to accept a gifted membership. Those memberships don't get applied. You'll pay for them, and they just go, bloop, they go away, they disappear. Do I get credit for them? No, from what I've seen, I don't get credit for them. But it's unclear what's going on because we've had two different people who've done it. One person said that it looks like their payment never went through. The other person says it actually did, but I didn't get the memberships. So where did they go? This is very confusing, okay? I don't know. Um, you would think they're gonna refund it, they better, or else that's a major problem, all right? So, yesterday what happened was someone tried to gift a bunch of memberships, it didn't work, but then a bunch of people who were on the stream said, oh, let me enable the old out, it was not gonna be a smooth process that would work right. I knew it. I said it, I said, every time YouTube rolls something new out, it doesn't work as intended, there's issues, and we have to work through them to figure out how it works ourselves, because YouTube doesn't even pass information. I was absolutely right. <clears throat> James says, how do you enable it? Apparently, from what I'm to understand, let's say, for example, someone just tried to get five memberships right now. If you don't have it enabled and you don't have a membership, a pop-up should appear on your screen in the chat that says, oh, memberships are being gifted. What are you doing here today? Tips has dramatically slowed down. It's actually hard now on any given stream for me to hit the $50 glasses goal. And that's a rarity. It used to be I would hit that all the time. It was dependable. And we're back. This is Mr. New Vegas, and I feel something magic in the air tonight. 2,000 years later. Yeah, like, wow. People are, are you know, like, shocked. Um, And it's one thing if it happens one stream, two streams, but... Julian! I don't know where I felt like I could get a little drink, right? Goal of $100 twice in a week, okay? That's not good. That's a definite downward trend that I'm noticing, all right? Now, I have two theories on why this is happening. The first is because right now, there's absolutely nothing going on in the It has not been easy for me. And you know, I, I started off in Brooklyn. My father gave me a small loan of a million dollars. I came into Manhattan. Almost no revenue on YouTube. With the amount of views that I get a month, I mean, I get like, I still to this day get like 700, 800,000 views a month, sometimes up to a million, depending on if it's a really popular month. And the ad revenue is abysmally low for that, okay? I need help. So if you can, check the description of the video you're watching. There's a tips link right there. The ring lasted a really long time and that was a big attraction. And now that that's done, everything I'm doing feels like filler content. WWE 2K22 is a game you wanted in March. I'm playing it late um, because I was too busy with the other high profile new releases. And even then, I feel like that's a niche audience, just fans of wrestling. Skyrim Anniversary Edition is a great chill playthrough, but it's just that, a chill playthrough. Phil, Four you make me angry, Phil. Could have just grabbed one of these, Phil. To see Zelda Link to the past, but it's not bringing in big time support. Tonight we did it, I mean, I mean again, 50 bucks, just enough to put on the Gunner glasses. Um, 
And Uncharted 2, I've actually noticed that of all the stuff I'm kind of doing right now is actually doing better than a lot of other stuff, which I appreciate. But even then, you know, it's not like we're consistently going crazy with, with, with support on any of these right now. And I just don't have anything else to play. Today I tried Sniper Elite 5. It's a dud. Ah, he's full of shit. <laughs> You can pledge to the Patreon and help that way. I know a lot of you already do that, so thank you. That is a, a concrete way the on-demand video watchers can contribute, okay? I do need help right now. I can't keep going this way, seeing, oh, it's been one week now, it's been two weeks now. Okay, this is going to consistently be this low, huh? Like, what am I going to do, you know? And I can't kind of sit around and just wait for a new game to hopefully come out that gets everyone's attention and someone will come back and support again. I, I basically need to let you guys know, yeah, it's really bad right now. All right, and I would really appreciate if you could be 50. So you pay $5 for a sub, Twitch keeps 250, I keep 250. That's how it worked over there, okay? Here, the split's a little different. It's more favorable towards the content creator. So for example, if you do a $4 membership, I make more than $2 per membership. I don't, it's not two and two. It's like they make like a dollar something and I make two something. YouTube gives you a more, a more favorable cut. All right, which is good. That's a nice thing, obviously. Um, what exactly is it? I have no idea. I haven't done the math. I haven't. What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. At no point in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything. I'm excited. I, I'm enjoying all the games we're playing. Really, I am. You know, WWE, Skyrim, Street Fighter, Zelda, Uncharted 2. And when we when I stream, we all have a great time. And the thing is, up to now, the philosophy has always been if everyone's having a great time on both ends, regardless of the amount of viewers on the stream, support will be there. Sadly, I hate to say the last two weeks, it's starting to really hurt now. So if you could, please help out, all right? And I will talk about this also on the pre-stream tomorrow for the live stream viewers, but I wanted to throw this out there for the on-demand viewers overnight so you really know what we're going through. All right, guys? Thank you so very much. Please have a good evening, and hopefully I'll see you tomorrow for another positive day of streaming. Peace out. <laughs> Just like a, a triple whammy, it sucks, right? I'm trying, and I've actually even tried asking you guys in the past couple of weeks, what would you like to see me play? And there is no consensus at all about it. None. Zero. People are... <laughs> Basically all want something else from what I'm playing, but there's no agreement on what it is. I want Metroid Prime 2. I want Hollow Knight. How about Devil May Cry 2? How about an RPG? How about this? How about that? With no common agreement. Okay? The good news is, coming up in June, there will be, years ago, uh, there's going to be a lot of stuff going on in the realm of Summer Games Fest, things to talk about on stream in regards to new game playthroughs and the like that. We're going to get release dates and stuff. We're going to have, on June 10th, a double new release day with, with Mario Strikers, as well as the new sur survival horror game, The Quarry, from uh, Supermassive Games. There's new stuff at the end of June. The problem is we got to get to this stuff. It's May 26th. I'm reliant on a daily... I'm the one who operated a successful YouTube channel. Me... Are you sure about that? Just that there's no new releases right now, but gifted memberships just got enabled on YouTube, and within a week I got a hundred of them. So people are like, oh, feels good now. No, gifted memberships will help this channel in the long term, but I don't get anything from that today. I don't get anything from that next week. It's gonna be the end of May when I get my monthly YouTube payment that I see any benefit. Problem is, everything else has been lower. When tips are lower, right when super chats have actually slowed down we have is obviously it's better for me to be here being able to stream and not being in bed with ear infections constantly right at the same time i'm going to suffer now during these months when i need the air conditioner on because i'm not going to be able to hear the games as well okay it is what it is there's not much i can do about it that's just life and i'll deal with it but i just want to let you guys know you're going to hear ambient noise now Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Came in and gifted a bunch of memberships in a short period of time that it would like, oh, feels like really good now for support. Actually, it couldn't be further from the truth. Everything else slowed down dramatically, and right now things are really financially tight for us, okay? In fact, you know, things that I don't really usually talk about that much anymore, but there's st some stuff going on that's making things financially tight for us even more right now. Some unexpected things that have happened and come up. 
I gotta appeal to my audience and let you guys know, listen, I appreciate everything you guys do for us. I do. Right now, it's a tough time for us. Things are very tight. Things are not going super well. Um, please understand how hard it is for me to make a video like this and, and ask you guys for anything when I know there's a thousand assholes out there all lying, saying defamatory statements about me and, and, and everything that's not true at all. No sponsorships, no partnerships. I don't run ads. I don't plug products on my, my, my videos or content. It's just me making truthful, honest gameplay and podcast style content for you guys and you guys crowdfunding me. All right? Right now, I need more help. Not, oh, it's another stream where Phil barely hit his first goal and it's the seventh stream like that this week. Like, that's, it's it's getting bad at this point, okay? Um, if you are on the live streams, thank you so much to everyone who supported in any way so far. Um, I hope that we can make a, a rallying and see tips increase in the next couple of weeks. If you're someone who watches the on-demand content, all right, you just watch the videos on demand at your own leisure here on the channel. There's ways to support outside of just watch. Worthless specimen, get that ass banned.